Welcome to the voice of the Lord. Our verse for today is in Galatians chapter 3, verse 26 to 27. You are all sons of God through faith in Christ Jesus. For all of you who were baptized into Christ have clothed yourself with Christ. This is good news for us, friends. We are sons of God because of our faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. And it, it is because we have clothed ourselves with Christ. But what does it mean to clothe yourself with Christ? Friends, the Apostle Paul clearly said that if I am crucified with Christ, that's how I clothe myself in Christ. Because he said in Galatians 2.20, he said that I have been crucified with Christ. It is no longer I that live, but Christ living in me. And the life I live, I live by faith in the Son of God who loved me and gave himself for me. That's how we clothe ourselves, friends, in Christ. Where we die to ourselves as if we have been crucified with Christ. Then when we resurrect, friends, in that new birth, when we are born again, it's no longer us that live. See, it's Christ living in us. See, we are guided and led by the Lord Jesus Christ through the Holy Spirit. So that we no longer live the way that we used to live, where we were enjoying sin. But no, we have been transformed. We have been translated from the kingdom of darkness and brought into the kingdom of light. The kingdom of our Lord Jesus Christ. So, because of that, friends, then we are sons of God. Are you not glad, friends, that you are a child of God, that we got a father? And our father is almighty God. He is almighty. He is all powerful, friends. He saves. He delivers and he helps us in our times of need. Friends, this is who we are today. We are in a blessed position because of our faith in the Lord Jesus. So my prayer, friends, is that don't belittle your relationship with the Lord. Don't belittle it, friends. You get a powerful connection with God himself through the Lord Jesus Christ. And if you believe that God heals, He delivers. If you believe that God blesses His people, His children, then count yourself in and enjoy all the blessings that God had in store for you. So, what are the issues that you are facing today? You got a father that you can approach and say, Lord, these are my issues in life. See, you've got a father that you can entrust your burdens to. And he cares because he is our rabbi, loving father. But there are times, friends, when you go through discipline. But again, even in those discipline, God loves you. Because we are told that he loves or he disciplines those he loves. So my prayer for all of us today, friends, is that let's continue to enjoy this relationship with God. Let's continue to avail ourselves of the benefits of being a child of God. And always remember that it's through the Lord Jesus Christ that we become children of God. Amen. We are born again into the kingdom of God. Because we have received Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior. So be blessed, friends. And enjoy your favored position in Christ. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May His face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. And lift up His countenance on you and give you His shalom. God bless. See you again next time. Bye.